best hopes is that we keep flexible learning and we don't like leave working on our iPads or anything and I also hope that it doesn't happen again. I liked that when I was in isolation that we got to spend more time with like my with my family and it just sort of brought us closer like that we'll still be able to find that time and that we'll still be able to spend more time together and do more things together. I wish we could re-celebrate the things that we did get stuck in COVID, like birthdays and like Easter and all those events that got trapped in the isolation of COVID. Um, yeah, it's quite sad because we missed a fair few events. I wish none of this stuff would happen, like, say if like, say like COVID, like all the droughts and fires, how really annoyed and everyone got scared like it was really hope nothing like covid like this happens again so we can just have a normal life and do what we would do every day like going to the park in the afternoon or having a walk and all that um well i wish that i could um go uh back to that because we're not too sure if netball's going back this season and I started it this year so I really like wish that um, we're able to get back. Like that we'll be able to get, get like more freedom to choose like what app to use for the projects because when we like I find when I do that I get to I can get more stuff done if I'm interested yep. in it and I like doing it and so just generally my whole thing gets better because we we do different projects and every person's like on the same different things but they all turned out different but really good. We get to go out more, do like go back to our old lives. I hope that we still use iPads and we don't just completely get out of it and do pen and paper because I really like doing the tasks and using different apps. Well, you get a lot of technical ability learnt from using iPads and it's just really fun to animate everything and uh, yeah, like inserting images and putting music into things. See more family because we had a bunch of birthdays that happened and we didn't get to see much of our family. And then they just sport like out of school to come back. I wish COVID never existed. Best hopes for the future for school after COVID is that we have seen how much our kids can achieve when we don't block them in, when we let them run. So when it comes to technology, our school's been on a huge uh, learning journey, but we feel that we need to learn everything first before we teach our kids. Our kids learnt what we've learnt in five minutes and then took it and absolutely ran with it. We got to see their personalities. We got to see how they communicate, how they justify their responses, what apps they like to use, what... Um, different programs, different uh, filters. It's just was so amazing to see what they could create. And when we're in a position of COVID uh, where our only communication was electronic, it really gave our parents an opportunity to see what we do as a school. Additionally, it gave our parents to see what their kids know, what we're teaching. They got to see all of our lessons. You know, we opened our classrooms to parents. Um, we opened our school to parents. We opened our personalities to parents. They got to see us in the rawest form um, through quirky little videos. And it was just really great that the community really got to get to know our teachers and get to know what we do every day. Look, for after COVID, I think it's really important that we get back into the swing of how everything was, but we don't forget the lessons that we learned through COVID. So. From a school point of view, we did some really fantastic work connecting with our community, connecting with our kids on a daily basis, and we built really strong relationships with kids because we didn't see them every day. So I really think we need to keep those things happening. Um, as a principal, it was great to actually show bits of my own personality, um, putting in videos and things like that. And they're things I would still like to be able to keep doing. So I really want to learn from COVID. I hope we don't have to go through it again, but take the things that we learned that were great um, and build them back into our everyday teaching and uh, learning at school.